Did you know the south entrance to Yellowstone National Park is only 56 miles from the town of Jackson? That's right, a trip to Jackson Hole really gives you two national parks for the price of one. Literally, the entrance fee is good at both parks. So if you have time, set aside a day to tour Yellowstone. Founded in 1872 under President Grant, Yellowstone is the first national park and has remained an icon of preservation in the American West ever since. From Jackson, the best approach to visiting Yellowstone is to start early and plan for a full day. You won't be able to explore everything, but a day trip still allows visitors to enjoy some park highlights and incredible scenery. Most of the main attractions are accessible from the figure eight, which is called Grand Loop Road. Visitors can access Yellowstone year-round, but summer and early fall are the prime seasons for exploring the park. Yellowstone offers a host of recreational opportunities, ranging from camping, hiking, backpacking, boating, and snowmobiling, but perhaps the most intriguing aspect of the park is its very unique geography. The park sits on top of the Yellowstone Caldera, an active supervolcano that is home to hundreds of geysers, hot springs, and thermal features. Waterfalls, canyons, lakes, and rivers also contribute to the breathtaking scenery. If you can peel your eyes off of Old Faithful, Lewis Lake, and Mammoth Hot Springs, you'll notice Yellowstone is also home to a wide variety of wildlife. From moose, bears, pronghorn, elk, bald eagles, gray wolves, coyotes, and bison, wildlife watching can be a full-time job in the park. If you have a small window of time, consider a commercial tour to Yellowstone so professional guides do the driving while you snap pictures and take in the scenery. There's so much to see, but exploring is half the fun. For more information, visit jacksonholetraveler.com where we give you the local insight to help you plan a better vacation.